podcast. Well, this debate is far from over. It's about the lines of political discourse and where exactly is the line of political morality. We'll continue talking about that story, the summer breaking news coming in. This is about the latest aid scandal. Delhi's Rouse Avenue court has extended three days ED remand of K. Kavita's close aid, Arun Ramachandran Pillai. That's the word coming in. Ananya Bhatnagar with us on the broadcast. Ananya, with this extension, um, you know, it's an important step for the Enforcement Directorate for custodial interrogation. Could you tell us more about the charges against the key close aid, Arun Ramachandran Pillai. What are the sections he is facing? What are the key charges against him? Well, he's facing Section 3 and 4 of the Money Laundering Act and uh, the major charge against uh, Arun Ramachandran Pillai is that he was a part and in fact he was the representative of the South group uh, in that particular meeting that took place uh, uh, between K. Kavita and various other people. In fact, Vijay Nair was representing the Amadi party leaders and we have seen how Arun Ramachandran Pillai has been stated by the ED to be the frontal face of K. Kavita into this whole excise policy scam and uh, that's the reason why in fact uh, uh, there was a demand by the enforcement director to also confront him with uh, uh, K. Kavita and uh, now since three more days of police custody remand of uh, uh, in fact Arun Ramachandran Pillai has been given he will be confronted with Buchi Babu is what uh, who is the ex-auditor of K. Kavita is what is said by the enforcement director before the court another important aspect that would come out in the detailed order copy of the court which would be out from in a, in a certain while from now is that Arun Ramachandran Pillai had recently moved an application before the court seeking uh, uh, to in fact retract his statement that was be given idiot opposed this particular demand of Arun Ramachandran saying that he had come out to the court very very late because the statements were recorded in uh, October, November and all then right. in December and uh, if at all uh, if there was something wrong, there was some kind of a coercion or a pressure on him, then why did he not approach the court then and uh, why is he approaching now? It is just a diversionary tactic is what the enforcement okay. director told the court. So what would happen to that is something that we'll get to know in the detailed order copy as of now we we'll get to know that three days of more police custody remand has been given out for uh, uh, in fact uh, quizzing uh, Anand Ramachandra Pillai in this case. All eyes on that detailed Bhuchi order Babu copy and as and when that comes Bhuchi. out and his testimony is going to be very important as far as quote unquote the southern lobby is concerned as the CBI and enforcement directorate has alleged in the Laker Gate case. We'll continue tracking that in much more for now slipping into our short stated.